Hey guys, it's Aaron. And Cameron. And Jack. There's Jack. Everybody's been asking, where has Jack been? Jack is here. Jack starts tomorrow. When you see this video, it will be today, tomorrow, Wednesday. He's starting a camp. What are you gonna learn in camp? Uh, computer, we're gonna have fun and stuff. Yeah, but coding. coding. Cameron's friend's calling her in the back. Um, we're on our way to get Miss Simmon, but the big news, the big thing about this video is, we picked the school. The kids are gonna be in school this year. No more online. No. And <laughs> so we're gonna talk about the school that they're gonna go to. It's in Rabat, it's in Suisi. It is called Kilbron, Kilbron, <laughs> Kilil Gabron, KGS. It's been here for 35 years. All right, let's go get our Miss Simmon and I'll talk about the school that they're gonna go to. All right, guys, I told you like a month ago or two months ago, they finished paving. Well, look at this, look at this. They put the lines. What's that face for? Look at the lines on the street. We have lines. Now, don't let this confuse you because just because there's lines, it doesn't really mean anything. They're not gonna really, really use them. There's actually a new sign, a light up sign that says stop, Six, and then another one says 60. 60 miles. Wait, it lights up? Yeah, at night. All right, let's go get our Miss Simmon. Just went across the Atlantic Ocean, walked 15 miles to get to my school. <laughs> then I had to cross the Mordanian Ocean to get to my school. We don't have to cross any of And I oceans. always made it on time, always. Even though I live 50 hours away. But it takes five months to go across the oceans. It takes five months to go to school? Yeah. So All right, I guys. Here's the mosque, and behind this mosque is where the Missimmon lady has her little shop. Best sandwiches. Best, best egg sandwiches. Yeah, she makes a good Missimmon. Come on, Cameron. This thing is creamy. Cheese. You gonna stay there or you gonna come? Come on. Let's go. How's you? Did you just walk like a Moroccan now? I think I'm used to it. Do we walk like a Moroccan? Yeah, like in the road. I don't care. I just go now. All right, guys. We came. Not open. Not open. We got to find something. I think there's a little place around the corner. You know the place that sells like the little white cups and then they have like Missimmon and they have other stuff? Hopefully, fingers crossed, they are open because these kids are hungry. All right, guys. We are at this little spot next to Missimmon Lady. They have the Ribe. My kids have never tried this. It's I've actually so never tried this one either. All right, go ahead. I think it's basically like a yogurt. It's not. It's not a yogurt. So it's kind of like a yogurt. It's really good though. That's so Your face if doesn't... Ice, if there's ice in it, it would be amazing. I'm not so it's not that cold? No, it, yeah. It's so cold. Do you like it? Really? Wait, okay, Cameron, try mine. Is yours colder? They're not real big on like really cold things in Morocco. Yeah, I'm a cold person. Do you like it though? Yeah, I like it. Mine's better. Ice cube. Or you just buy them and put them in the fridge. What's the flavors? What do the flavors taste like? Strawberry. What's the green taste like? Lime. Lime. A lot of strawberry. All right, guys, are they right? Is it strawberry and lime? All right, guys, so we got our stuff. Cameron had second thoughts about it. Jack, you still like it though, right? It's refreshing. I like the, it feels I like the strawberry, but not the lime. You don't taste it's refreshing. My only issue would be I would love it to be much oh colder. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. <laughs> Actually, he has a video. Is there a lot of gaming stores here? Uh, in Rabat. What? All right, so KGS. 35 years here in Morocco. It's, I believe, all over the world, though. Um, uh, the total amount for both my kids to go, obviously full-time, it includes lunch, transportation, books, uniform, the tuition, and a 10% discount because I have two kids enrolling, and registration fees. The total amount is 148,000 dirhams, approximately. <laughs> which means it's approximately like $14,000, $15,000 for the year for them to go. That's crazy expensive. He says it's crazy expensive, but the Rabat American School, I can get a whole PC with that. the Rabat American School is $50,000 for them to go. 50, 50 US, 50,000. Jesus. Yeah. There's an Crafts store, can we go see? Yeah, let me finish though. All right, so the breakdown. Here is the breakdown of the schooling. Registration fee for both of them is 24,000 dirhams, which is 2,400 US dollars. 
um, tuition. Oh crap, guys. I'm having a hard time remembering these numbers. Canteen. Canteen is 6,800 dirhams, which is $680. And then uh, transportation for the both of them. It's tw 12, no, 24,000 dirhams. Wait, so you're not taking us to school? No, the bus will pick you up. No! Oh, Are you kidding me? No. Do you think I'm trying to go Do to Rabai? Do you know how much cramped that is? is? Yeah, mommy, no, the buses here are really we cramped. We saw yeah, the buses. Those are cramped. But I think that is no. for, that's for, this is a good school. No. The buses won't. No. I will look into because the buses here drive, drive. because I know I know what they're talking about. We have seen some school buses where kids are just like, looks very crowded. However, how am I going to breathe? However, you will breathe. Hold on. However, I do believe it also an amount of money. It. He finished it. That you're paying. This money, this school is not like, you know, a cheap, cheap school. So I'm going to obviously bring that concern to them. Here's the, here's the things that you need to know for language. It is a British school with the yeah, Cambridge curriculum and uh, they do teach Arabic and French. However, my kids only have to take a test in English and that's only Jack for his grade has to take an English test. Um, Cameron's still too young. <laughs> yeah, you will be taking I'm it. I'm nine. Yeah, you wanna take a test? No. Okay, so that's good. <laughs> so anyway, um, they don't have to take that. Uh, they offer all the act extracurricular activities including your regular you know Cora basketball volleyball but then they have judo judo What's dancing judo? swimming What's judo? judo is karate I think some type of karate I'd rather go in MMA I'm not doing karate I'm mommy doing... I'm really good at chokes and I want to do dance you want to do dance uh, I want to do um jujitsu mm, I want to do jujitsu mommy I'm what really good I can put you in a it's, joke and you'll lie, mommy. I'm not even joking. Okay, why would you want to do that to I'm your mother? I'm my, my He can't do me. All right, this is going to be fun to edit, guys, all these captions. No, don't. don't no, edit. I'm saying it's going to be... No, I'm saying to edit the captions. No, there's like a little place on here. All right, all right. We're going to go check it out. So uh, that is what you need to know about the school. KGS in Rabat, in Suisi. It is a private uh, British curriculum school. 35 years That's here. curriculum. And it's costing us 148,000 dirhams a year for the both of them. All right, guys, we are outside of this place. Jack saw it went by. He's like, this place looks good. I don't know if he realizes it's like the national sandwich of Morocco. Um, and the guy actually told me it's actually a Spanish sandwich, but you can find these sandwich places all over in Morocco. Um, I have ordered actually from this place before. I think maybe on Glovo, but for sure when I first moved here. But I haven't been back inside the store he gave me permission, I'm gonna show it to you. It's so, they just opened up, so everything is like not touched for the first customers. Show you what it looks like. I wanna tell you, it's like the American Subway. You pick your bread, you, well, you don't pick your bread, I don't think. Or you do pick your bread. You pick your meat and you pick your toppings. It's literally American Subway, but a whole lot better and healthier. All right, so they have uh, sausage, jez, beef, and then you have your pasta, rice, I don't know what that is. What is that one? Oh, it's potatoes. Oh, the orange is throwing me off. Potatoes, olives, carrots, lettuce, onions, tomatoes. So it's basically, like I said, you pick all your stuff. Uh, fries, they can put fries on it too. And then look, there's more meats in the back. What? Here's their menu. We have different mozzarella sticks. Yeah. You want mozzarella sticks? I thought you wanted to drink. Grandma's house to eat lunch with Soraya. We, we mostly have fish on like Mondays and stuff, and it's so good. Before I was like, I don't know, I don't want fish. But now I love fish. I actually tried it, and it actually tuna tuna tuna. 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 tuna.
fell on her shirt and she said, oh no, my salmon, go, go make me some more salmon. Oh, that's the new Cinderella. No. The one with the blonde hair. No. I think I know what you're talking about. It's in the 2000s. Yeah, yeah, the new, it is newer to me. It's not the original Walt Disney from the 60s. Yeah, the prices are really good. Yeah, mommy, it's kind of new. And look, they just came and delivered some rolls. Ryan was born. Yeah, 2006. Okay, Jack wants, what do you want, Jack? Uh, I want, mommy, we put it on what? It's okay. It's okay. Um, what do you want? Rice. Rice? No, 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 no. Small, a bit of rice. 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 Um, a bit of lettuce. Sweet lettuce, because he doesn't like a lot. Lettuce. lettuce. That's good. That's, what else? And fries. And the fries. fries. Well, olives? Fries. No, no, no. no. Fries. Fries. Mayonnaise? Mayonnaise? No. What kind of sauce? Nothing. No sauce? Mommy, mommy, was that sauce mayonnaise? No, it's what you had that was before. Listen, so then, uh, Soraya... Yeah, but you had this sandwich before, this? and this is what you got. Is this chicken? Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right, that's it. Yeah. That's it. To go, in board day. And I want Sprite. Yeah, okay, get your Sprite. Dude, this is going to feed a whole thing. Yeah, get your Sprite. All right, Cameron, you've had this sandwich before. Jack. Same? Mother. His first bite was all bread. Mm -hmm. We're waiting for the second bite. That's good, though. Bread is good. Of course it's good. It's Morocco. Okay, ready? First, I'm gonna try fry. Okay, well, fries are fries. Actually, that's not true. I take that back. Not all fries are equal. I put this in there. Yeah. Okay, ready? All right, Jack. So take a second bite. <coughs> Don't die on us here. My mouth is dry. <coughs> My mouth is dry. All right, we'll take a time out for a drink. All right, guys. He's back with the second bite. That's a big bite. Ooh. You like it? Mm -hmm. it's How can you even see it? This kid needs a haircut, guys. He says no. <laughs> it's gonna be annoying when you go swimming. <laughs> All right, guys, so that cost us two sandwiches, two drinks. It cost 58 dirhams, so about less than $6. Good price. Less than $6. Two big sandwiches, two drinks. Well, that's so good.